The Chamber of Commerce held their annual meeting with special guest Joe Theismann, and today he left many people inspired and motivated to make the best next step in their life. What a neat idea to be able to talk about the analogy between the world of sports, the world of business, and when you really think about it, it's about our own personal lives. And so I'll tell some stories, we'll have some fun, and, and show how all of those three, those three things really marry up together, and that each aspect applies to each part of our life. Theismann shares similar perspectives that was in the same conjunction with football and in business. I fashion myself more of a guy like Joey Appleseed. I just want to plant some seeds to individuals, then you nurture it, you make it grow, and if it doesn't fit you, perfectly fine, but at least it was something you looked at. During the luncheon, Jonesboro Chamber of Commerce honored several Jonesboro residents, including Amelda Williams, Jamie St. Pierre, Mayor Harold Perrin, and Adam Sarden. Instead of talking about change and challenge, look at it as an opportunity, and so we're looking at Crystal Seth Park as an opportunity to serve our community of Northeast Arkansas, and, and anybody that's welcome to come in to say, hey, you, can, you, you and your family can get in your car, stay safe. This year they have reworked the concession stand area so people can enjoy that experience as well. He plans to make it bigger and better this year. Sarton did take note on what Theisman spoke on when it came to attitude and self-reflection. I think he, he best said, you know, cheer yourself on. So when you get up in the morning, uh, don't walk in there and look at yourself and say, you know, oh, today. Get in there and say whatever's going to cheer you up so that you can tackle the day. Now, Joe Theismann did mention how much he enjoyed his time today in town and is looking forward to coming back again. In Jonesboro for Northeast Arkansas News, I'm Sydney Thompson.